those of you just joining us, my name is Drew Packy. I'm the host of the show, and speaking of shows, we have a great one for you today. Stay tuned. So this week, there was a lot of chaos. This chaos was caused by, well, major complications in the distribution of the COVID-19 vaccine. In many states, counties got very territorial with their vaccine doses. Some counties even went to the point of refusing to vaccinate people from other counties within the same state. Now, this isn't to say that a lot of people weren't vaccinated. They were. However, there was just a lot of chaos engulfing the whole process. One thing's for sure, this virus is out of control. I mean, seriously, a few days ago, the total COVID-19 deaths hit 400,000. In less than a year, 400,000 Americans. And this, remember, this number is just America, right? We need to pressure our government into getting this virus under control so we can get back to our lives. So many people have lost their livelihoods because of this pandemic. Get it under control already. On to the other news. Now, some of you might know that this week, the stock market was very, very volatile. This was mainly due to people suddenly investing in GameStop. GameStop, at first, was trading below $100. After all the Wall Street chaos, it is now trading above $400. Federal regulators are looking into exactly what happened. Now, one thing's for sure. We need to figure out a way to regulate Wall Street without impeding the people's freedoms. Now, there is a downside to federal regulation of Wall Street. If the government regulates Wall Street, innovation will be stifled. Now, you might ask, Groove, what does innovation have to do with Wall Street regulation? Well, the answer really is that if innovators and inventors see that the government shuts down stocks that are too volatile, they'll be less inclined to make their product public. For me, personally, I don't know which side of the issue I'm on, because I seriously understand why Wall Street needs to be regulated, but is regulating Wall Street worth the cost of stifling innovation and invention? I don't know. All right, that's our show. For those of you who haven't subscribed, subscribe and uh, check out our merch. That's our show. Good night.